Hey, it's Colin here and it's Tuesday. So that means it's time for Tip Tuesday. So this week I'm gonna give you a second tip and that's working with different sized images. You know how it is when you've got one big one and one small image and then you drag one inside the other one, bits are missing or there's all this empty space around it. Let's have a look at dealing with that right now. So here we have two documents. We've got this nice big photo that I took from my quadcopter and then we've got another one of a cover. Maybe we want to composite this in or whatever, but notice we've got a very small document and a large one here. So I'm going to drag the large one in and I'm just going to release it and we've got this big image in there. So what we want to do is show the whole thing. So we're going to go up under image and then we're going to choose reveal all. And this will rechange the canvas size. Notice right there so we can see the entire image. So that's uh, our first tip. So let's just undo this for a second and I'm going to go into our second tip, which is going to be what if we're going the other way? All right, so we're going to take this tiny little image. We're going to drag it into this massive ocean of a big image and let's hide the back one. And now we've got all this transparency around there. So you could crop, you could do different things, but the easy way to do this is to just go under image and then we're just going to choose trim and choose transparent pixel and bang, voila and now it trims to the size of there. So as you can see, this is great tips for um, changing the size of your uh, canvas to match the size of your document. So I hope you enjoy this. Don't forget, hit the subscribe button, check out photoshopcafe.com and come back and check out Tip Tuesday next week. So until then, I'll see you at the cafe.